All right, now let's focus on your forecast. First alert meteorologist Ron Smiley standing by. And you know what? We've been talking about fog off and on yeah. a few mornings uh, lately. And once again, we're talking about it. Yeah, but otherwise, we're actually in for a pretty decent morning, Ron. Yeah, it's always a good day when uh, the big thing you're talking about is fog as you're starting off the day. And we do have some fog out there. So if you're leaving early, maybe heading towards uh, I-70, moving through the Wheeling area, we do have some thick fog out there there. And also down to the south, maybe Morgantown, Connellsville, Dilling. Uh, with technically some dense fog pockets that uh, do extend over into parts of uh, Maryland, including both the uh, Garrett County and Allegheny counties in Maryland. So just to kind of give you a heads up there, there's some thick fog at some of those higher elevations this morning. Hey, temperatures, it's 52. We're starting to see the fog being impacted at uh, or being seen at the Pittsburgh airport. Even though visibility is perfect, they are showing mostly cloudy skies right now. Our dew point is down into the 40s, so it is very dry. The air mass that is in place. Temperatures this hour 52 in Pittsburgh, Zealy and Opal 46, Washington 47, and Irwin coming in at 53 degrees. Overall today and really over the next week, cuppy weather will be in place. Little to no rain is expected in dry conditions actually should help or at least this little bit of rain should help in a couple of ways. First off, our fall foliage colors. I know a lot of folks you like to go out. I'm the one too. I, I like to go out and look at the uh, gorgeous colors uh, on some of those trees. That should be uh, really good over the next couple of weeks as the uh, colors start to come in. And, and we're also going to be looking at for farmers. This is a time that they like to uh, uh, roll hay. Uh, so these dry conditions will allow that to happen as well for the next week or so. High pressure, even though it's to our north, it's going to be sliding by. We will have some winds in the mid levels, at least out of the uh, northwest. That will pull in some moisture uh, over Lake uh, Erie that will bring some cloud cover our way. So it's not going to be crystal clear with our clouds. Uh, we'll call it partly cloudy, but there'll be times, especially if you're north of I-80, uh, I uh, where you'll be dealing with mostly cloudy skies. 73, your high temperature today, 52 into the overnight hours. Most places should be hovering around that 70 degree mark. Further north you are, look at those temperatures up in Franklin. You might even struggle just to get back to the mid 60s with the clouds that will likely be in place. Here's your forecast 9 o'clock 55 noon temperature at 68 72 at 3 o'clock your 6 o'clock temperature right there at 72. It's going to be another cool one as we're heading into the overnight hours with temperatures hovering again near 50 degrees. So 73 today, 77 on Wednesday. The thing you're not going to see on the seven days any rain chances. In fact, probably our best chances for rain coming next Sunday and Monday, but right now I only have those rain chances coming in at around 20%. So this is going to be a nice dry stretch. Pleasant weather, but still a dry stretch uh, to the forecast over the next week.